Hey everybody, how are you doing? I hope you're doing wonderful. This video, we're going to talk about how to become an X die steak delegator. Now place the point of the steak directly over her heart and hit as hard as you can. No, not that kind of staking. And not that kind of staking either. What are you doing? Come on. So if you're interested, delegators, what was their battle cry? Mount up. Delegators, mount up. All right. I'm going to try to find the chart and put in that actually shows the different levels of staking because there's uh, and, and how to get passive income with XDAI. You can use the easy staking. You can be a delegator. You can be a validator. You can be a roller skater. Well, I got a brand new pair of roller skates. You got a brand new key. But I don't think you get passive income for that. It's a little early in the morning. And what I did was I freed up some stake that I had in the easy staking platform to be a delegator you've got to have a thousand x die stake all right so i'm going to walk through just basically write down this list of stuff to do here and hopefully it'll be easy to do but i reckon we'll find out all right so the first thing that you need to do is to get your x die your stake over to the XDAI chain. And you're going to do that. And I'll put this link down below if you haven't used this before. For the Omni Bridge. This is how you get your stake tokens over to the XDAI chain. Where there'll be stake on XDAI. A little confusing because XDAI being the ticker over on the Ethereum chain for stake. It can get a little confusing. And I totally get it. If you have used HoneySwap, this part is not new to you, all right? I'm just going to move this many stake over to the XDAI chain. And this does take a little bit, so I will be speeding it up. Now, you are also going to need some DAI that you're going to move over to the XDAI chain as well, where it'll be XDAI. <laughs> Hence, that's where the confusion comes up. You're going to use a different bridge to get the die over there, though. There we go. It is now over on the X die chain. Now, if you want to move die over to the X die chain, you're going to use a different chain. Why? I don't know. I didn't make it up. I'm just trying to show you how to navigate these waters. I didn't. <laughs> I didn't design the system. But you're going to do die to the X die chain over here on this one. It'll be different. Now, the good thing is, is if for some reason you try to put die in here and move it over on this bridge, it's going to give you a link and say, hey, dumbass, go over this other bridge. All right? So there we go. We got it over on the X die chain now. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to switch... over to the XDAI network. Now, for those of you who haven't used anything on the XDAI chain now, it may be a little bit slower uh, sometimes. However, the fees are ridiculously stu uh, stupid low. So if you're always bitching about gas on Uniswap, you're gonna totally dig what's going on over here. All right, so we switch to the XDAI chain. We got our XDAI stake and our 
X die over there. What does it say to do now? It says go to block, block. It says go to blockscout.com, which I have right here. Now that it's live, it's this one right here. Apps. And what the video said was that you can click on any of these three things right here. And that it would take you to the correct interface. So let's find out. All right. All right, so it shows me with here's my balance of stake. So as we look down here, we can see who the different validators are. Interesting. All right. It says, find a candidate pool you would like to place your stake on. You can view current validator pools. Blah, 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 blah. All Okay, that's interesting. Now, I have no idea how to, at this early state in the game, I have no idea how to judge uh, who to go with. It appears that these guys are hitting a slightly more frequency. But there's already one person that I have to would have to share the delegators portion. Does it make more sense to go with the slightly higher ratio or to go in the one where I don't have to share with anybody? All right, fuck it. All right, this is the guy I'm going with here. We'll call him Stan. We're going to stake with Stan. Actually, no, no, no. In honor of a conversation we were having in the Telegram group last night, we're going to call... This validator, Yvonne, just so I have a reason to put her picture up on the screen here. All right, so what it says to do if I want to stake is to click this right here. So let's stake on this guy right here. How much do I want to put on there? <laughs> So let's, we're going to try it again. I got an error message there. It said, wait, it for, wait a couple of blocks. Let's see what happens here. And here we are the next morning because that issue never cleared up the rest of the evening. But it looks like it has cleared up now because there are other people that have joined since last night. So. <laughs> Let's do what we were trying to do last night. There we go. Now, later, when it's time to claim our token, we're going to do it right there. Now, my understanding is that you can also claim your rewards, put them back in and stake them as well, kind of like compounding, or you can take them and send them somewhere else. 
I think I'm probably just going to keep keep them here. But you can see right here. There we go. I be staked. Let's check our list to see if there's anything else that I'm supposed to do. All right. So here at first, I guess... I don't know how long an epic is. But I guess once you join, you sit the first one out and then you start earning on the next. Now, as far as what are the gains? And they're generally gonna be more at the beginning, just like they are with, with anything and there will be later on because you're sharing less of the pie with other people so you get a bit of bigger chunk of it okay so as a delegator the delegators will split I think it's 70% as a validator you always get 30 at least 30 it says and more if delegators contribute less than 70% to the pool. Okay. An epic, staking epic is one week. Ah. Hmm. Wow. I wonder if these were the rewards. Okay. So I guess the answer is, I don't know. We'll see, huh? <laughs> All right, well, that's it. That is really it. It's really that simple. So I guess I'll do an update when I start getting some traction and getting some rewards. All right. Well, you guys have a wonderful rest of your weekend. Sunshine, lollipops, rainbows, unicorns, and all those good things to you and everybody that's important to you. And we'll talk to you next time. Bye, con huevos. Shake it. I ain't never seen no country girl shake, shake it.